Hello traders and welcome back to ChrisFX. Today I'm coming to you with yet another fantastic trading strategy that can easily get you funded. For those of you who already know me, you know that I'm not showing strategies that everyone else is showing, but I'm showing things that will actually help you pass your funded challenges. I'm helping traders become funded and also I'm teaching them the best trading strategies which can easily get them quit their 9 to 5 job and live the life of their dreams. So here we go with yet another free strategy. First of all, I'm gonna tell you that since November 7th, the 7th we have had zero losses. Okay, zero losses and the proof is exactly right here. The buy limit on GU, I'm sending only very high quality signals. And there you go, you can see this was a break even, this was a win. Then. This was another win right here. Then we sold Nasdaq and I'm gonna show you those trades, which was an amazing win. Earned 3.8% to my account with this one. And if I move forward, you will see that this was another trade, which we caught from the beginning. I'm gonna show it. It's exactly right here. If you see, this was the other trade that I'm gonna show you, which was again another win, as you can see. And then we had this sell on Nasdaq, which was again another win, guys. So only wins in the trading signals group. This strategy has to do with the way that I'm trading. Not exactly, of course, if you want to learn exactly how I'm trading, you can go ahead and join my academy or an one on one mentoring or, of course, the trading signals. But this strategy is based on fair value gaps. I'm going to show you the basic logic of what I'm doing. And as you saw, we caught this trade, which would be very easy for you to catch as well. Let's teach this strategy only on the 15 minute time frame. Well, this specific trade, first of all, went, let me see, all the way we entered here with the stop loss right above this area. The stop loss was right above this area, 15 pip stop loss. And before you say that this is a lot, there you go. This trade went up to 7 to 1 reward to risk. Now, how is this strategy working? Like the basics of the strategy. Not exactly the rules that I'm using, of course, but how does it work? This strategy is taking into account fair value gaps and impulsive changes of character. Of course, it can be an impulsive break of structure as well. Here the logic was, let's talk about the logic of this trade as well, after this very impulsive move on Tuesday, then when I saw this reversal with a change of character, and I'm gonna zoom in so that we can make it look clear, we saw this change of character right here, so immediately I was very interested in this FEG over here, and if I played forward, then I was also interested in this FEG right here. Now, I have very specific rules on how I entered, but I'm gonna show you a small trick that I have shown in the past. Let me show you. There you go. Here, we have what I called in a previous video, which you can find on the top right of your screen right now, where I was talking about liquidity staying above almost equal highs. And those guys right here are almost equal highs. This week that you see right here and this week that you see right here. Why? If I go to the one minute time frame, you will see that those are almost equal highs. So yes, you can claim that we grab the liquidity above here and now this will be the real move. This is for the one minute time frame. But on the 15 minute time frame, you can see that those weeks right here, this and this, this one and this one are creating liquidity in order for price to penetrate them. Probably, you don't know that one more time, in order for price to continue towards the downside. Now you can say, which FVGs do I have above those weeks? I have this FVG right here, exactly right here, and I have this FVG over here. Personally, I entered my trade somewhere around here. I'm not gonna get into where I entered and why, because this belongs to the premium. 
but I will tell you that you can already do that. You can already enter without any confirmation. You can place a pending order. Again, now the stop loss went above this area. There is a very specific reason why the stop loss went above this area. You can either place your pending order, your sell limit exactly right here, or you can place it right here. I usually go for the lower one. I'm not being greedy. But if you would have gone for the highest one, the higher one, you would be activated into the trade again. Now, look how nicely this trade played out. Personally, as I said, I was activated all the way down here, okay, for 15 pips with a 15 pip stop loss. But for you, you can use this strategy right here as I'm showing it with a pending order. Now, the positives of this strategy are that you will be having an amazing reward to risk. So if you would be using the strategy as I'm teaching it right here, the seventh one that we got, let's say, would be a 14 to one, even more as I sit right here, would be a 17.7 to one, another 10 to one reward to risk. Of course, with a very high risk, compared to the other one, because the smaller the stop loss, then the harder it is to get either to get activated into a trade or probably the higher the probabilities for you to get stopped out of the trade. Because if price makes it all the way back here, there is a very high possibility that this would go ahead and penetrate you even more. So it doesn't show a lot of strength, even though, of course, price was very strong towards the downside. You don't know that in retrospect. Now, with the same exact logic, as I said, of the equal highs or equal lows, where above them there is a fair value gap, there you go, those almost equal highs, they don't need to be exactly equal, those almost equal highs, on a lower time frame, as I said, if I go even to the 5 minute or the 3 minute, you will see there are two highs here and above them there is a 15 minute fair value gap, two fair value gaps. Just you can place your pending order as it is, as I said, with a stop loss above this area. And you can target, let's say, instantly those lows as an example. Okay, now this thing will give you more than one entries. Let me continue now. Where is the next low? The next low is this low right here. And actually we can let the trades run. So let's let this trade run in the background and then we can say now if we break this overall area impulsively and if we see the same exact thing happening as we do see it right here, okay, then we will probably be willing to enter yet another time. Now we have an FG, but with this strategy that I'm teaching you, you have to see equal highs being formed. Price is testing the breaker block. Let's see a little bit forward. Let's move a little bit forward, guys. Nothing here. And of course, this can take even more time. There we go. Now, almost equal highs have been formed. Of course, you could be entering instantly from the breaker block. And according to my rules, it's not only the rules regarding the breaker block, but here this would qualify for a trade. I have very specific rules. There is no room for discretion at all. Nonetheless, what we have right now, almost, almost equal highs again. Take this whole area right here, okay? Almost equal highs. What is there above them? There is liquidity right above them. And also there is liquidity above this area now, right here. What do we have above all of those areas? We have the 15 minute FVG that we talked about. What did I say? You can go ahead and place your pending order instantly. Okay, this, if it is a very large stop loss for you, you can go for the half for the middle of this week and you can target whatever you want to target. Let's see then. There you go. This would have activated you. This was news, by the way, on the news, right on the news. And if you think this wouldn't have activated you, it would have activated you because the spreads would have activated you into the trade. 
the spreads would have taken, let's say the actual price would have been somewhere around here. So you would have been into the trade right on the news. I do not suggest that you do that right on the news, but look at that. Some people are trading the news. There is no problem with that at all. A full 4 to 1 instantly. Now, let's see if we have something similar. Let's see. Here, it is a little bit more tricky because you don't have exactly equal highs. Probably if you go way lower, on a lower time frame, you do have those equal highs already here. So you can look at the lower time frame for the equal highs if you cannot identify them instantly. And on the 15 minute time frame, it is a prerequisite that you will have an FEG. What are you going to do? Again, the very same thing. Pending order, you don't need to place the stop loss all the way up there, middle of the week, again, all the way down there. Let's see. Let's move forward. Beautiful. There it goes. Here, you have a bunch of fair value gaps all the way in here, FEG, FEG, FEG. You don't have the exact equal highs that you have, for example, where was it? Right here, this with these are almost equal highs because I can realize that these are equal highs almost from the 15 minute time frame. If you cannot go to a lower time frame, here we had those almost equal highs where there is liquidity above. Here again, we had those almost equal highs. Third example, and always an FVG above them, but here you don't have something like that. So let's see nothing like that. Here you see we have changed character exactly right here. You can say now, and I don't know this example, I don't remember, that those are almost equal lows in this occasion. You see this one and this one right here. They are almost equal lows. Below them there is a 15 minute fair value gap. So your pending order in this occasion could be going exactly right here with the stop loss all the way down there. I'm not quite sure if we get activated. This is amazing. Actually, we got activated here. You won this trade as well. And believe me or believe me not, I don't care. This I didn't remember at all as an example. Only by following this amazing, spectacular strategy, guys, you can get funded. Very same thing right here. If you would like to do that, we are going to current price action. There you go. Your FVG is here or the lowest FVG, almost equal lows again. Low, low. There is FVG. There are two FVGs. You take the trade either here with the stop loss right there or here. And let's see where we are right now with price action. This is something that probably somebody can do exactly right now as of the making of this video. This would be absolutely fine to do, guys. So it was pretty much the same logic that I got a trade on Nasdaq, a very, very nice trade that went up to 4 to 1 instantly, the one that I showed you. And over here, by the way, you could be making money, guys. You could be making profits again and again and again. And if you are the type of person who is going to make it, who is going very, very strong, okay, and he's letting, for example, he wants, let's say, this person who has big cojones, he wants or she wants this FEG to be filled in. So here, he or she is targeting with all of his or her trades this specific FEG to be realistic or the beginning of this FEG, 7.4 to 1 and a 6 to 1 and here a 2 to 1 reward to risk. Well, I got only the first trade, which is more than enough, of course, but I am also in the process of moving in my new house. I have moved and things are a little bit more difficult. I'm still, I still called only winning trades within those weeks that I was moving. Of course, it is impossible to always, let's say, call winning trades. I would have been a billionaire and I'm not a billionaire. But realistically, those are strategies that you can use. The ones that I'm teaching you right here, they are for free. You don't need to pay anything. But if you want to take your game a step further, let's say, then I invite you 
to join any of my services and I guarantee that to you that you will not be dissatisfied. You will come back and you will tell me, Chris, you were right. I, this thing I guarantee to you, go ahead and read the reviews that people have left. So this was our today's strategy guys, hopefully you enjoyed it, again subscribe to ChrisFX for more free educational content and to my other channel, The SMC Trader, leave me a like, leave me a comment and then join my exceptional services. This is gonna do it for today traders and thank you all for watching, until next time.